Hello, welcome to this video. This video is an extension to the previous multiple file upload demo. And we will see how to perform operation on multiple files which we upload. There is an assumption here that the files we upload have the same column variables. And what we are going to do is we are going to take data from all the files and we are going to merge them in a way that uh, the data goes one below the other. In other words, we are we are going to do a R bind, row bind on the data present in different files. Let me show you what I'm talking about. So if I browse the file, I've got two files here my data and my data copy it's the same data just for demo let me load them and all the tabs whatever you see here we covered in the previous video i have added a new tab called merged data set where we will see the outcome of the merged data set and here you can see that i've got the first 10 observation from file 1 and then that got R binded to the data set which was present in the second file or file 2 and then I also have the download button here so if I click on this the data set will be downloaded to my system I am in server.r and I will take you to the section where I have done the coding for the merge or R bind, row bind. So I've got a reactive function here. The name of the output object is, or the reactive object is data merge. I'm checking if the file is loaded or not. If it is null, means no file loaded, return nothing. Else, I'm counting how many files are there using n row on input dollar file. It gives me, say for example, I loaded two files, three files, or n number of files that gets stored in a variable n files. Then I have created a, a list object. I've named it as CSV and it's an empty list right now. Then I have looped in saying for i in one to n files. Means for i in one to whatever number of files we have. And then what I'm doing is I'm reading the files one by one and storing the data in this list. So each element in this list is nothing but the data set for each of the files. So the first element in this list is the data from first file. The second element will be the second data set and so on. Then I'm calling do.call. I'm saying that perform the R bind operation on each of the element. So what, what will happen is all the data sets will be R binded or row binded. And then the resultant or the outcome of the um, row binded data gets stored in data merge reactive object. And then I can use this object to display table and I can render the table. 